Live from Morsham High School is the man himself. Good morning, Joey. Good morning. Lovely to see you this morning. So, How look, are you? you went back to school in order to, to, to try and get a GCC. What happened first time round, Joe? Um, what, the first time round, meaning when I left school real life? Yeah, when you did your GCSEs um, first time round. Yeah, it didn't go too well for me. Yeah, it didn't really go too well for me, you know. I've done my GCSEs all over again twice as well. So I did worse the second year after that as well. And I thought, I might as well come back to school, you know, do one GCSE to prove to myself, I think, more than anything, and to uh, educate the world and myself. So was it different then, second time around? Because now you're a big star, you know, you're very successful. You go back into the classroom as a very different Joey yeah. Essex, don't you? Was it different? <laughs> Yeah, it was a bit different. It was a bit, it was a bit strange being like in a classroom with, um, with the, like these kids that I used to be like that, and like it was just weird. It just, it just didn't feel real almost. It felt like I was going back in time. I mean, the weirdest thing for me was having my phone. Like you didn't have mobile phones with cameras and stuff when you was in class back in the day. So that was sick. Like we were just getting selfies and that. But it's a serious school. Like they, they take your phone off you and all that. If you get it out, it's too serious now. <laughs> they do do that. They do do that in school. And what about that school smell? Do you remember when you go it's into limited. the school corridors? It makes me feel a little bit nervous, actually, when you go yeah. back in and you smell it. Did you get that as well? Yeah, I did, to be honest. I did a little bit, yeah. Like, it's weird as well, especially seeing people in all school uniform around the uh, school and that. They tried putting me in a school uniform, but um, it didn't really fit me at the time, so... Um, I swerved that one, but yeah, it, do, it does. It does. It smells like very classroomy yeah, in here. Yeah, of course, of course. So they couldn't find a, a school uniform that fit would fit a 26-year-old school student. <laughs> Is that the problem? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I think I was. Yeah, I think I've grown up a bit since then. But um, I mean, I just I just walked around the school. I mean, I got I got told off to be honest. It was like non-uniform day. Um, <laughs> But they didn't mind. It was only for one day. So look, Joey, you did general I studies. You did general studies day. GCSE, didn't you? How do you think the exam went? Do you know what? I don't know. Like back in the day, I used to come out the exams and think, yes, I've done really well. I used to generally have that in my head. And I've sort of got that in my head about this one. But then I remember I used to come out of the exam and then obviously I didn't. I thought I'd done well and I didn't. But um, I mean, let's, let's have it right. An A star would be an absolute dream. I mean, it, it, that wouldn't be real to me. I don't think that's going to happen. But um, being realistic, I'm not going to mug myself off, but I'm, I'm hoping for like a D. That's me being realistic. But I'm going to predict myself a D plus, which basically is a C. <laughs> like the logic, like in, the logic. In, in Joey World it is. So look, we want to see just how much you've learned, Joey. We know you're opening your results later, but we've got a couple of yeah. questions from previous general studies exam papers. Uh, so we're going to give you a chance to see if you can come up with the oh, right answer no. to these. Well, this will give us an indication whether you're going to get your D plus C or whether that A star is... I believe in I'm you, Joey. Speak. I think you're going to do brilliantly. Yeah. Should, should we go for it? General studies, though. It, what even is general studies? I've, you just well, studied you just it. it. OK, look, let's do a question. The first question is, the government department responsible for funding art, theatre and music projects is A, Department for Culture, Media and Sport, B, Department for Education, yeah. or C, Department for International Development? You've got five seconds. What are you going to go with, Joe? A. You're right. A. Yes. Very well done. A star done. for the first question. Yes, mate, okay. educated guess. Educated guess. I had a 33% chance of winning, yeah. Well, you're not bad on your maths as well. Let's go for your second question here, Joey. Let's go with your second question. Uh, what term is used to describe the central turning point around which a force acts? Is it A, clamp, B, bracket, or C, pivot? You've got five seconds, Joe. 33%. The axis of which? Um... B. Oh, it's not B. a bracket. It's a pivot. It's a pivot. Remember, I've seen pivot. you pivot on the dance floor, oh, Joey. I, I would have thought you'd have known that. I'd have thought you'd know that. Quickly, the last one. And finally, oh. when considering people of several different ethnicities, religions, languages and traditions, is a definition of A, multiculturalism, B, inclusion policy, or C, the European Union. 
So considering people of several different ethnicities, religions and a. languages. A, you a. got it, Asian multiculturalism, just on the buzzer. It. Let's have a look. You got it right, Joe. Is that right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, mate, two out of three. What are you saying? That's what are you saying for Joe, so Joe, that? Joe, it's 66 percent. Two out of three, 66 percent. That's what a B? That's a B that's pushing what, an A, I saying, think. Man. <laughs> that is. That's sensational. Above average. <laughs> you're more than that. You're, you're, you're a wonderful character, Joe. OK, we're going to let them open those results. Now, so if you take them out for us nice and quickly, and I'm going to go for the big smile here on the end. Megan, how did you do? I got an A star and two Bs. Oh, my <laughs> goodness me. Better than you thought. Really, really well done. What about yourself, Liam? I got an A and two Bs. That's a what I needed. What 